how I made $26,999.44 on Instagram in one month without showing my face. Here's the screenshot to back it up immediately. Um, and it's actually in euros. So if you convert that, that's more than, than uh, $26,000, right? It's probably more like 28 or 29. But this is not from my theme page, okay? Well, well technically it's not. Uh, but to do this, you'll need to understand how theme pages work, okay? Uh, and I've literally seen people make $200,000 per month with the same exact strategy that I'm going to openly reveal it to you just in a second, okay? Uh, the best part about this, you don't need to show your face, you don't need to have sales calls, you don't need to have any specific skills either. You know, you don't need to be like a world-class copywriter or, or whatever, right? Um, if you learn this correctly, you'll be able to do this in, in 10 years from now as well. Like this works everywhere and it will work 10 years down the line, it worked 10 years ago, the, the concept itself, right? So here are some more screenshots <coughs> to back it up. Um, here's some lifestyle, you can check me out on Instagram. Um, just so you know, like, here you go, just so you listen over here. Um, so just to remind you, this is not an agency, this is not copywriting, this is not growth operating, this is not doing sales, remote sales, this is not trading, this is not drop shipping. Okay, and this business model only requires just an understanding of social media, understanding of driving traffic to a well-converting website. It doesn't need to be your website. Um, you need some negotiation skills, okay? And that's it. And before I fully reveal the strategy here, who am I? So my name is Arnas. I run this theme page called Passionate Income. You can check it out yourself. Like you can, you can Google it on your phone if you're watching it um, on your laptop right now. It will pop up. This is my personal brand on Instagram. You can check it out as well. So my story, I started Passionate Income four years ago. I'm 21 years old right now, traveling the world for the past two years, perfected my business model, and now I make more than ever before. And I met a lot of cool entrepreneurs due to the nature of my business. And over the past two years, I coached over 100 clients and helped them succeed with what I'm about to show you, okay? This specifically and more, obviously. I have endless testimonials, interviews, case studies, etc. Here are some of them. You can pause the video. I really went in depth into all of this a few videos ago on my YouTube channel. You can check it out, more trainings, but you can pause the video, check it out. All of these people worked with me. So how did I actually make $26,999.44, uh, actually euros on Instagram in one month without showing my face? Well, I'll show you everything from A to Z in this video. So ever seen a theme page, just like I showed you, Instagram theme page. This is my theme page. You don't need to have a million followers to do this though. It, it, like you don't even need to have a theme page in the first place, technically, but this is a theme page. You probably follow a bunch of them and you never realized it's a theme page. It's someone running it behind the scenes without showing their face. And it's around one niche, right? This is how it looks. You can check out, like probably if you press on the people you follow, uh, on your Instagram personal account, you'll find a bunch of theme pages, at least 10, I'd say. I mean, if you're an Instagram user. So why am I talking about theme pages? Is this about running a theme page? Not really, it's not. I, I, I love theme pages and I preach that it's a great business to start, if done right, but this is kinda something else, okay? It involves theme, th theme pages, but it's not just good old grow a theme page and monetize it. You see, for you to make $26,999.44 on Instagram with this, you don't need to have a million followers like I do. Why am I talking about theme pages? Well, they're easy to start and grow, reaches tens of millions of people monthly, easy to make content for it, but most importantly, most theme page owners have no idea how to monetize their following, okay? And when someone offers them money, well, they sell promos for pretty cheap, right? They have no idea how to make money. Someone slides in their DMs, they're like, hey, I'll pay you 100 bucks, I'll pay you 200 bucks, I'll pay you 500 bucks, depending on the page, right? They're, they're gonna take that money because they're, they're not gonna make money in any other ways because they just have no idea how to do it. What you'll learn in this video will help you to take advantage of that, okay? So think of this, there are hundreds, if not thousands of theme page owners 
having no idea how to convert their millions of views into actual money in the bank, right? That, that's their biggest problem. And you see, most of these people, they don't really look at this as a business. Most of these team page owners, they just got kind of, I, I don't want to say lucky because I don't really believe in 100% luck. They already obviously did the work needed, but they, they grew that page and, and they have no idea what else to do. But they're getting these inquiries. They're making their two, three thousand dollars a month, cool, whatever. But they have no idea how to scale that to like thirty, forty, fifty thousand dollars a month because they don't have the skill. But you do. So what did I do to make that money, and how can you do the same? So first, having a theme page with fifty thousand to a hundred thousand followers in a specific niche will help you a lot and save you a lot of money here. Okay, so. If you already have a theme page with 50,000 50, or more followers, that's amazing, okay? If you don't, well, you can either grow a page like that yourself or buy it for 500 to $1,000, okay? There's gonna be some back and forth and you'll need to have conversations with these theme page owners, but you can definitely buy pages for 500 to $1,000. I bought them multiple times. I'm buying them, I'm selling them. Like, just follow me on Instagram, you'll see like I'm consistently buying and selling pages. As I said, you don't need one, but it really helps, okay? Like if you, if you can have the small kind of page, really, really helpful. Having an understanding of theme pages in general will help you a ton. And that's why I recommend running a theme page for a few weeks yourself to get the hang of it, okay? So when you understand how it all works, it will make way more sense. I'm just gonna cover all of that just in a second, okay? So let's say you have a small theme page like this now, what are your next steps? By the way, this page is my page, okay? This is one of my smallest pages I have. And I wanted to show this as an example because you can do this on a very small page, okay? Like, you, you don't need millions of followers. I bought this page, um, I don't remember exactly, but I think I paid $350 for it or $300, something like that. Um, and it has really good US audience and all of that. I deleted the old post, so I, I changed the name and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, it's 57,000 followers. It, it's not really active page. I, I forgot about it long time ago, but I'm just showing this an, as, as an example. Like you can buy a page like this for 350 bucks, 500 bucks, right? You, you'll have that as kind of like, uh, you, you're testing it out, right? If you can't invest that money, this will take you a bit longer, right? It will take you a few months to actually grow to that 50,000 followers because when you do grow a page, I mean, going to 50,000 followers is probably the hardest um, like time, time frame, right? Because you're really trying to figure it out. You don't know what's going viral, what's working, what's not working. So the first 50,000 followers are the hardest, but when you hit 50,000 followers, I mean, you already know what's working. You already have viral posts. You just keep doing what's working and you'll grow way quicker to that 100,000, 200,000, so on and so forth. Um, obviously, this page has been at like 57 or 60,000 for a long time because I'm not posting. I'm just posting some random promos there. Um, but you will need to monetize that page. <laughs> and you're probably thinking like, duh, obviously, like, okay, okay, how, how is that gonna make me $30,000? Like, it's not. A page like that won't give you $30,000 per month, but let me explain why we're doing this, okay? What we're doing here is trying to find proof of concept, okay? We're trying to find a product which fits perfectly in your niche and can make some money with a, with a small page like, like that, okay? Just like this page, if you can find a product, if you can find a winning ad creative for this page, and it can make money, that's all we want. If you can make three to $500 per month with a page like that, that I just show you from 50K to 1,000, uh, from 50K to 100,000 uh, followers, like you found a gold mine. And let me explain, like you're, you're not gonna make all the money from that page. It's just a proof of concept. That's all we want. That's all we want. We want proof of concept. We want to know what's working right now in the market and what's not. So how do you make that money? Well, you can, like th that 500 bucks, you can promote an email newsletter and make money off of co-registration. Every subscriber that, that comes, you'll make $1 to $2 per subscriber as they come. Okay, so for you to make, let's say 500 bucks, 
you'd need around 250 emails to 500 emails, right? Something like that. And if you can collect that in a month with a 60,000 follower page, you're good to go. Doesn't sound that hard, right? Because it's not, it's very simple. Uh, so you can do either that. I covered this actually in one of my trainings called like how to make 20K per month, or whatever, stably. And I covered email newsletters and this <coughs> specific strategy, right? So you can check that out. It's on my YouTube channel. Uh, you can sell a well-written ebook. The title and the promise of it is the most important. So what you're gonna do, and I learned this from a guy who's doing a million a month selling eBooks, okay? You're just gonna go on Amazon, find the most popular and trending books in that niche, and try to come up with very catchy title and a cover. You know, the saying, don't judge the book by its cover. Well, there's a saying like that because people do judge a book by its cover. They just see the cover and they decide to buy it or not. So you need to come up with really good title, to be honest, and really nice cover for your ebook. And that's it. Like you, you can use that, promote that on your page, try to make that 500 bucks. I mean, if you're selling an ebook for like 19.99, all you need is like 30 ebooks after fees and that's it per month. So one ebook per day. It's definitely possible. I've done it before. I, I sold like a $17 ebook. That was like my first money ever with theme pages. So yeah, and I didn't know anything about ebooks. Like I didn't know anything about promoting and I still made that money. Okay. Uh, you can do affiliate marketing for another company. So maybe you landed an exclusive deal for your page and now you can make money from that. So you, you can do outreach on LinkedIn and be like, Hey, we have 60,000 really inspired entrepreneurs or housewives or pet lovers, you know, whatever, reach out to brand appropriate brands, try to land an exclusive affiliate marketing deal. Not the one they're, they're offering, you know, to on their website, Oh, sign up as an affiliate, get like 5% of our revenue. Now try to land something incredible. And that's another way. Uh, and, and for more ways of monetization, you can check out my YouTube channel. Like I would personally choose one of those three here. Uh, but you can, you can do so many different things. And I cover all of that on my YouTube channel. I have so many videos. I, I think I have close to a hundred videos right now. So you can check out, I have multiple videos on monetization as well. So, okay. Now you make three to $500 per month with a small page, but that's not 30 K, right? Exactly. So we have a proof of concept now and we can scale that like, Simple, right? If you can make 500 bucks with a small page like that, you you can probably make 30K with like 3 million followers, right? But you don't have 3 million followers. I mean, obviously. So if a creative or ad does well on a 50,000 follower page and converts into money, it will convert very well on a million follower page, right? It will convert maybe not 20 times better, but maybe it will convert 10 times better. You'll still have great returns, right? Like if you could tap in to their network of a million followers, put that ad in front of them, put your product in front of that, like you'll make money, right? You would make more money because you already know it's working in your niche. You're making money with it already. The ad creative is just like working insanely well. So you know it's working, but you don't have a million followers though, right? Right. Remember when I told you that these theme page owners usually have no idea how to monetize, right? Yeah, exactly. So they're not treating their page as a business. They're looking at it as a side hustle. They don't put, put much effort into thinking about monetization. And I have a lot of clients like that as well in my coaching program where they come at me and they're like, hey, I have like a million followers and all I'm doing is selling shout outs I'm not treating this as a business. It takes me like an hour a day. I'm happy with it, but I really want to scale to like 30K, 40K, 50K a month, right? They're, they're not doing that because they have no idea about business. They're not treating their page as a business. They're not treating it as a company. They're just seeing it as like, a, okay, the money's coming in on demand. I snap my fingers, I get some money, whatever, it's working. I, I, I'm living my best life, right? But like you can take advantage of that, right? That's why all of these people sell shout outs. 
they're a great way to make money for them and great for somebody buying it as well. Because like when someone sells it, for example, I have clients who want to change their situation right now. But I mean, for the past two years, they've been just selling shout outs alone. They get some money from a shout out. They're like, cool, I have the money. <laughs> okay. Like they don't care. They get the promo sent to them. They make a few grand a month. They're happy with it. Some, some actually make like 10 grand a month from shout outs alone. But we're not going to get into that, you know, today. Uh, and the person who is buying the promo, obviously they keep buying because they're getting a good return. So the client's happy. The business owner, the theme page owner is happy. They don't think much. If they could, they would want to make more, but they don't think much about it, right? So for example, I bought promos from a million follower page for $50, okay? And like this might seem ridiculous. I know, I, I, I know it sounds crazy, but listen up. Here's how you do it. Here's how you take advantage of it. So first of all, you don't buy post shout outs, okay? Because everyone buys post shout outs and no one buys story shout outs, okay? So if you know anything about Instagram theme pages, you usually see these ads. They, they post the ad, oh, go follow my friend, uh, Paul. You know, he's doing amazing. Follow him to learn about Airbnb arbitrage or Amazon FBA or dropshipping, whatever. You see these all the time. Well, that, Amazon guru or dropshipping guru paid the page like mine to post that, right? And that comes consistently. Like sometimes I get three or four posts a day, to be honest. So that's pretty consistent. But story shout outs, probably I get asked for a story shout out every other month or so. So for the page owner, when someone buys a story shout out, they see it as free money, okay? Because no one buys it. Like no one buys it, right? So if someone comes in and they're like, hey, I'll give you money for a story shout out. You're like, yeah, just give me whatever you want. I'll just make extra money that I usually don't make. So what does that mean for you? It means if someone is selling a post promo for like $150, they're likely to sell a story promo for around $60, obviously after some back and forth. So these numbers, by the way, come from my personal experience of spending $20,000 on story shout outs in one month, okay? So I know what I'm talking about, I've done this. Um, so is it starting to make any sense now? Like, does that make some kind of sense? You have a small page, just like this. You find a winning ad creative by promoting one of the three things I mentioned earlier. And this is by the way, just a random ad I wanted to put a picture, but you obviously would do a story ad. And I'm not gonna get into details like how do you create this ad or whatever. Like you can definitely figure it out. Just scroll on Instagram a bit, scroll through stories, like you'll see plenty of story ads. Um, that's the hardest part. Like to find the winning ad creative on your small page and make some money from it. When you have that figured out, it's easy from there. So when you have that, now you have a winning story at creative and a monetization method that's working. Okay. Just you're in that situation right now, by the way, if you want my help with all of this and more DM me the word coach on Instagram at owner Arnas. So when you have that story at creative winning at creative, you reach out to hundreds of pages who sell shout outs for very cheap. So for example, this page specifically sells very cheap shout outs, right? Um, what you'll need to do is you, you'll need to learn how to negotiate with these theme page owners as well. You know, the first prize they'll give you is never the price you're going to pay them. So if they say, how, Hey, how much you charge for a promo? They say like 300 bucks. Yeah. Forget about it. Um, so if they ask for like $150 per story promo, like you counter at $30, literally like you, you don't want to overspend you, you will make the money here on buying cheap shout outs, not on promoting something, okay? You, you make the money on the buy, not on the sell. Does that make sense? This is the most important part because let's say if I would buy that promo, you know, for a hundred dollars instead of 150 or instead of like 50, I, I would buy it for a hundred dollars. My return on ad spend will shrink like in half, okay? So, 
you want to follow up with them relentlessly and agree to do a test promo for like 50 bucks, okay? So obviously they say 150, you say $30. They're not gonna be like, okay, boss, let's do it. No, they're gonna be like, oh, I can only do 120. And then you come like, what about $35? Like I I'm looking to buy a lot, uh, you know? And, and you'll need to learn how to negotiate, but they're just conversational skills. It's nothing too crazy. You go back and forth. And uh, let's say they'll say like, okay, $70 is last, you know? And then you're like, $50 is my last or $45 is my last. And they're like, okay, $60. And then you're like, okay, let's meet in the middle at $50. You see what I done, did there? Let's meet in the middle at $50. It's not the actual middle, but we, we, we use these strategies all the time in the conversation to kind of land the best deal possible. So we relentlessly follow up they want that money because it's free money for them. They don't want to like sell it for really cheap because then it doesn't make sense for them, but you want it as cheap as possible. I mean, don't offer them $1 for promo. It still needs to be some amount of money that makes sense for both sides, but you really need to like follow up relentlessly and negotiate. And like when they say that price, they're just throwing out the highest price they can think of, okay? Like they'll throw out the, the highest price um, they're, they're willing to do it for, okay? But they, they can go down like way lower. So from my experience, the first price they'll tell you for a story promo and the price you'll pay will be like 70% off or 65% off, okay? So you're, you're actually gonna pay like 30 to 35% of the first number they said. So 150, 33% of that would be 50 bucks, right? So that's what I would pay if they say 150, I would pay 50. So whenever you buy that promo, you send them your winning ad creative plus your link with instructions when to post and all of that. You kind of communicate with them because you already made that 500 a month or 300 a month with your small page. So now you send them the winning ad creative the link to drive the traffic to, and you post the same exact story that worked very well for you on your page. And you post it on a page in the same niche as yours, but like 20 times bigger, okay? So the best return on ad spend I had in 24 hours with this was around 21X. This is in 24 hours, by the way. I spent $50 on a story promo and made around 1,070 bucks or 1,064. I can't remember the, the exact number. I, I made that back in 24 hours. So that's around 21X uh, ROAS. When I found it, like uh, when I found it was working well, I purchased a bulk package of story promos, okay? So I bought 10 or 15 promos from multiple pages uh, upfront for a big discount. So just to give you an example, if I ran a test promo for that $50, so first of all, they said 150, I ran it for 50 as a test promo. I say, hey, this is a test promo. If it goes well, we'll run more promos, we'll buy in bulk, right? This is just a test promo. So we run it for 50 bucks. And then after that promo, they obviously want more money. They're like, okay, did you like it? Did it work? Did it not work? And then what you do is you buy in bulk if it really works well. Okay, if it doesn't work well, you move on to another page, right? But you want to do this with multiple pages at the same time. You, you don't want to put all of your eggs in one basket, right? So then I bought 10 promos for around three to $350 because I'm telling them, look, I'll pay you upfront for 10 promos. I'm taking all the risk. Here's 300 bucks. So you get another discount on the bulk promos, okay? And again, you'll need to negotiate. You're making the money on buying very cheap promos here not on anything else. So do you see how this works? You buy or grow a page to, to 50 to 100,000, let's say 50K plus. You test out a bunch of products and a bunch of ad creatives on that page, on your page. You find a winning product plus creative. So your winning product could be your newsletter. It could be an affiliate marketing product. It could be an ebook, whatever it is. You reach out to hundreds of theme page owners and negotiate with them. Then you run one test promo on a theme page in the same niche as yours with your winning ad 
and your winning link product, right? Whatever it is. If the return is good on that page, you'll double down and buy 10 promos. And if the return is bad, you keep going and you find more pages. Keep in, keep in mind you want to do this with multiple pages at the same time. So this is literally how easy it is to make money online. You don't need to overcomplicate things. Too many people overcomplicate things. Obviously, I left out some small details in this training, but you can get the whole idea, okay? And keep in mind, like after you do this, you can keep on going and going and going. And if you don't have money, that much money to invest up front, no problem at all. Run a few test promos. If it works well, buy in bulk, make your money back, and then reach out to the same pages and be like, hey, remember when we ran those 10 promos for 300 bucks? Did you? Yeah. Remember? Okay, cool. Um, I actually made like 5x on my money. I made 1500 bucks from your $300, right? From you doing all the work. Why don't I give you a commission so you can promote this every single day and I'll give you 50% commission of my ebook. Okay, that's how you scale. At first you buy the promos. They see it's working for you. You show them the screenshots. Hey, look, this is just from your page. Like I made 1500 bucks. You can promote this on your own and, and get commission. Then you have zero, zero risk in this. You, you're not risking your money. You're not risking anything. You're just paying them commission. But obviously to convince them to promote your product on commission, like you need to build a relationship. So obviously, like I said, I left out some small details, but at the end of the day, this is super simple. Too many people overcomplicate making money online. It's way easier than you would think. I met so many, <clears throat> I don't want to say it like that, but I met so many stupid people making a hundred times more than you're probably making, okay? There are people making millions who are way, way, way number than you, okay? And same as me, like same as me. I'm not trying to tell that I'm the, the biggest guy online or whatever. I'm just a small fish in a big pond, that's it. Like I'm a small guy compared to all of these big, online gurus or whatever, who are making millions. And trust me, there are so many people you've never seen before underground, which have, I don't know, 300 followers and they're making all of this that I showed you and they're making 200 grand, 300 grand a month, okay? So this is all possible, don't overcomplicate things. It's not that hard, I've done it before and 100, uh, over 100 of my clients have done this as well. So we're simple people. We just like relentlessly wanted to improve and figure this out. That's it. So you could literally do the same thing. You just need to take action and stop thinking about it. You know, oh, I'm thinking of starting this theme page. Oh, I'm thinking of doing this. Oh, I'm thinking of starting of doing that. Like stop thinking, start doing, start now. If you want to join the community of winners and be mentored by me personally, you can DM me the word coach on Instagram at owner Arnas. See you in the next one.